Good morning. I'm proud to stand here with this tremendous representation of the great diversity of our city, the gorgeous mosaic that the Big Apple represents. We're here today, we're black, we're white, we're Latino, we're Asian, we're young, we're old, we're working families, we're middle class, we're Christian, we're Jewish, we're Muslim. We're not divided, we're united on behalf of the best interests of the one million students who are in the New York City school system. And we understand that we must provide our students with the highest quality education so that we adequately prepare them for the challenges of the 21st century. And we're in a crisis right now with hundreds of thousands of students who may have believed that they were proficient, who are not proficient, who have lacked the adequate preparation that they need in order to be successful in our society. And make no mistake, we're at risk right now of dooming them if we don't change to life sentences of disadvantage That's right. and despair. That's right. Now this is an administration uh, that prides itself on grading others. They love to grade everyone and everything. Well, I think that it's time that some of us grade the administration. There you go. And when it comes, and, and when it comes to this test score debacle, I think there's really only two options, a D for disaster or an F for fraudulent. Because this is a crisis of immense proportions and we don't need rhetoric, we need results. We don't need spin control, we need scholastic achievement. We demand change, we expect change, we demand a comprehensive plan, we expect a comprehensive plan, and we will not rest until every single student gets a first-rate quality education in New York City. Woo!